The federal government says all is ready for Nigeria to take delivery of the COVAX vaccine against COVID-19. Minister of Health Osage Haniwe said this while briefing journalists on the outcome of the Federal Executive Council meeting. The minister said all conditions raised by the company supplying the drug have been complied with. TV360's Jerusha Maribu now reports. It is the last Federal Executive Council meeting in February 2021, and the top of the issue at the meeting is a much-expected COVAX vaccine, which is being supplied for the country for free. The company producing the vaccine in collaboration with the World Health Organization and the Africa Union is making available free vaccines for African countries. Minister of Health Osage Hanire said distribution to Africa starts soon as the country is ready to take delivery of the consignment. COVAX will start delivering to African countries before the end of February. That's what they told us. But they didn't tell us which country is first or which is second or which is third. So COVAX begins to deliver before the end of um, um, uh, February of this month. And we hope that before the end of this month it will be our turn or latest by beginning of next month. As for us here, we are ready to use the vaccination once it arrives. We have met all the conditions. They have asked us to sign what you call an indemnification form. We have done that. The indemnification means that you do not hold us responsible for anything that happens from using this vaccine. That's a standard process. We've signed that indemnification, and uh, so we are waiting for the vaccines to arrive any time. I don't think that they will arrive in all African countries at the same time. They will arrive one by one, stage by stage. But the order in which they arrive is determined by COVAX. The Minister of the Federal Capital Territory, Mohamed Bello, while also briefing journalists, said FEC approved 5.9 billion naira for three projects under the Ministry of the Federal Capital Territory. Two of the memorandums are for infrastructure development within the FCT and one is for the purchase of needed equipment to make the city safe. The first project or memo presented was a contract for the rehabilitation of the road leading to the Federal Integrated Staff Housing Estate in Upper Tafia area of Abuja. The second infrastructure project relates to the contract for the construction of an access road and car park for the Abuja Light Rail Station at Ring Road 2, otherwise known as Kukuaba Station. That is a very important station. It's the station that you see if you drive on the airport expressway immediately after the city gate by the junction of the Kukuaba Recreation District Park. The road contract is to be completed in 18 months, while the equipment is to be supplied in six weeks. Jerusha Amaribu, TV360, Nigeria.